in this video we're revealing how to make money on Vimeo. Now, complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More at that after the intro. Hey guys, Mike Fasil here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, to remind you that Silver Spots have opened up for this week's free workshop where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for a link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days. Check it out below. So before I built an online business that went from $7 a day in the middle of August to $300 a day in passive income and also building another business where in the past 30 days we've netted about $61,000 net in the past seven days we've netted about like $13,000 net. There was a point in my life back in 2015 where I was just kind of like tired of all the businesses that I was trying because I did not get the freedom that I actually wanted. And I remember looking around and just looking, well, what was the opportunity out there? What can I actually do that will actually make me more money that did not have to trade my time for it? And that's when I realized that a huge potential actually existed on Vimeo to actually go ahead and make money. And it was when I actually figured this out that I went from like the physical area of, of businesses, right? And the traditional ways of making money with the physical world to actually figure out a way to make money in the digital landscape with virtual products and softwares and services like Vimeo. And it completely changed my life. Like I remember with like a Vimeo product style launch, which I'm gonna share with you in this video, we were able to launch it where like in a single day with the launch, we generated about like $2,000. And at that point I was like, oh my God, this is real. This actually works. I had no idea. So to actually break down how I go ahead and do about that. The first step that I realized is the difference between Vimeo and for example, another platform like YouTube. Why do people go ahead and make videos on YouTube and why do other people make money on Vimeo? Well, both of them have two different, for example, roles. YouTube is essentially the marketing machine where you go ahead and give as much free content out there as possible because the more content that you go ahead and create and the more keywords that you rank for, the more people can find you and they could go and see your products and services. The ads that play in these videos are just kind of like a bonus, right? Like when I really started focusing on this, that's how we went from like $8 a day in August 12 to like $70 a day, which is like pretty cool. But then when it hit $300 a day, I was like, oh my God, this is like more than I would have made if I would have stayed in college to become a dentist, like what my mom and dad told me I had to become. And of course, as I kept on figuring out this method I'm gonna share with you, of course, you know, it started going even crazier where now like on the past 28 days, we're averaging anywhere from $1,000 a day on the low end to $1,496 on the higher end, which is insane because I never thought this was actually possible. So that's exactly what YouTube is. You put content out there and it's free. Now where Vimeo comes into play is Vimeo is essentially where you sell the products and videos for certain courses that you wanna go ahead and do. Like for example, some of my old courses was actually on like the software right here, where if I pull up any one of these things, all of these were actually hosted on Vimeo. Like if I go ahead and for example, see this, this is where I built some of my old courses and you could see that there's all of these things right here in this pretty little membership site. If I pull out any one of these videos and open editors, for example, I go ahead and see what goes ahead and pops up. I could go ahead and click on this video and you can see that this is a Vimeo product. And the reason why is because it was able to be locked in this membership platform on my website so that people could only access the video the moment I get paid from them. So what people are using Vimeo for is more of like a, like a professional selling your video style thing, right? Because YouTube, you know, you just post it up there, it's free. You can't really sell your YouTube videos because it doesn't have that, you know, like, oh, I paid for something vibe. YouTube is free, of course. If you create a membership site and all of it is hosted on unlisted YouTube videos, it doesn't have like that professional feeling. It won't allow you to garner that specific level of sale that you wanna go ahead and do. Which is why a lot of course creators don't use YouTube videos in their, video, in their courses, right? They use Vimeo because it gives you a more professional feel. You could take away the Vimeo branding. You could customize the logos, the colors, the designs of it. So it ultimately feels like it is your own video hosted on your own platform, which is what most people do. Like I said, that's essentially what I ended up doing in the beginning to make money with Vimeo. Essentially what I did um, to go ahead and do this is I remember you know, creating a piece of content and be like, okay, I wanna go ahead and create a course in some place, right? And I'm gonna house that course on Vimeo with the videos. But I gotta ask myself, well, what course do I wanna get into? I need to start getting some type of proof of concept. So I remember I would make videos about like, for example, e-commerce, right? And I could go ahead and type e-commerce and all of these things pop up. 
what this essentially tells me is YouTube's telling me, oh, if I create content about this, people are gonna go ahead and find me because this is what people are searching for. And so I would realize, okay, well, I just gotta put this in the title and if I do that, people would go ahead and find me. And when they do that, check this out. I literally rank for the first page of this. You could see my uh, cute little mug right here, Mike Vasile, how to start an e-commerce business. And now I'm starting to build an audience where now I can launch them a specific product. Back in the day when I really figured this out, I wouldn't sell anything until I would get some type of audience to go see me through videos that I rank for on search, right? And I did this for everything. I did this for even a fitness product. For example, with Jump Rope, I saw Jump Rope, um, jump rope Transformation and I saw all of these people making videos. So I was like, okay, well, what if I do this one? Because I see people searching for all these, but I see this one is on the top. If I make a video of this, maybe I could rank on the first page of YouTube. And you can see when you're there, I'm literally like the second option, jump rope transformation, me like jump roping my transformation. And you see that there's nearly a million views on this, right? So this works for literally any single niche that you want to go ahead and sell. For example, Vimeo products you. And that's just like the first level of it, right? So I would go ahead and promote it, ask them what is it they want, send them out a survey, and then when you know they tell me exactly what it is that they want, I would then just go create the little mini course, upload it on a Vimeo, and then put it onto my membership site and then start making money that way, right? So that's just one way. Another way that people make money with Vimeo is their affiliate program. So check this out. People need vi vi uh, video softwares for their courses and whatnot. And the coolest thing about this is you don't have to create a Vimeo. You can literally just recommend people to Vimeo and you can earn five to $100 per sale based off of the subscription plan. So let's actually see the opportunity with that. If I just type in, for example, Vimeo review, right? And I click on space. Let's see if anyone's actually searching for it. Right now, nothing's popping up. So that's not necessarily a good sign. But if we pull up, for example, Vimeo, you see that it's low and there's 100,000 people that are looking for this. If you start doing YouTube versus Vimeo, you make a video on this, it's very, very low. So the odds of you getting found are a lot higher than most people actually go ahead and think. And if you're able to go ahead and do that, then you could go ahead and just promote something like Vimeo. You're like, oh, this is YouTube, but this is why people choose Vimeo. And if you wanna get it, check it out in the link in the description. And just like that, if you go ahead and do that, you can get five to $100 per sale. And this is essentially it. These two ways are how a lot of people are making really good money with Vimeo. And not only that, but we do even more so on the back end. We're like, I literally have mentor mentors put all of their courses on Vimeo, and then we go ahead and, for example, sell that course, right? And that's exactly how, with a course that I did not have to create, with uh, someone else uploading it on Vimeo, you can see how we were able, in the past seven days, able to pull in 13,000 net, and in the past 30 days, we were all able to do about $61,000 net without having to create my own product. So if you wanna learn how to do that, and you wanna learn the fastest and easiest way to make money online, then sign up for this week's free workshop because we have a 62-year-old woman go from zero to $160,000 profit in 90 days with no experience. And check out my podcast of all these multimillionaires that live here in Bali. Like this guy that makes a million dollars per month profit and this 11-year-old girl that turned on $30 million. Check it out right here and right here. Hopefully this helps. Love you guys, see you guys later. You.